<laughs> so yeah. Rhode Island, smallest state in the U.S. Yeah. That's the yeah. one thing I know about it. It's so distance north to south, 48 miles. East to west, 37 miles. That's crazy. Think it's about that how short, small that is. Yeah, 48 yeah. miles and 37 miles. That's like from here to Lebanon. Yeah. Wilson I mean, that's County. where, I mean, how many people work there that don't live there? There might be a ton. You don't, because if you don't, it's 40 miles long or wide, long, whatever. North to south, it's 48 yeah. miles. So, yeah, I mean, you're in 37, so, I mean, you could just live right outside and go drive and you'll be 15 miles to the middle, mm-hmm. you know? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, you would, you could easily not live in Rhode Island. It almost would make more sense. Yeah, it was, Providence is right on the edge, too. You see, so, I mean. So you're, most you're, people don't even. You're probably five minutes from uh, whatever this state is. Now, it's the. Massachusetts. It's the smallest state by size. It's the second most densely populated state, though, in the country. They've got over a million people there in Rhode Island. What are they doing? What's the most dense? New Jersey. Okay. Uh, that's crazy. Yeah. New Jersey's that packed. And Rhode Island is, I mean, Rhode Island as well, that packed. Yeah. yeah. God, that's crazy. There, man. Yeah. They only have five counties and like 39 cities, but they're pretty good sized places. It's a lot um, going on. Do you yeah. think people from Rhode Island are against DC statehood because then they'd no longer be the smallest state? I don't know. If like they like being the smallest state. I think we well, you got to take pride yeah. in what you got. Yeah. And you're like, we're the smallest state. Uh huh. Yeah. And then if you're the second, nobody cares about the second smallest state. No, I mean, what's the second smallest state? Yeah, we don't even, we don't know. even know. We don't even care to look it up. We yeah. don't even, we'll find out. Yeah, we'll, we'll find, find out eventually. We'll find out eventually. <laughs> Here's the second smallest state. And the third smallest state, you can be like, well, we don't even talk about that. We can move yeah. on about other things. Yeah. But this, what, what would the second smallest state be? I bet it's one of those New England, maybe yeah. Maine, some Delaware or something like that. Yeah. Connecticut, maybe. That's my guess. Connecticut's big. I mean, it's kind of big. Yeah, compared to Rhode Island. Oh, Delaware definitely bigger than Delaware. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I don't know. They yeah, they might not like it. Uh, yeah, that's something to hang your hat on. Welcome to the small state in the U.S. Yeah, it's kind of a cool thing. Yeah, it's fun. I think. Yeah, we don't need to be that big. We get enough done. You know. Yeah. How much land do you guys need? Yeah. Yeah. So it got its name, Rhode Island. I mean, there is an island there. Most of it's mainland, but there is an island there called Rhode Island. And it got its name because explorers, there's a couple, t- there's two theories. One said because the island has red clay, road means red. And the other is because it reminded explorer of uh, an island in Greece called Road. So when they came there, they just named it Rhode Island. Mm-hmm. How long did it take that guy to get there? You know, <laughs> just to get there and go, this reminds me of the road in, uh, <laughs> in Greece. He's like, when were you in Greece? <laughs> 45 years ago? I mean, like, I've been coming here for most of this time. He's probably I mean, mad. He's yeah. Like, I could just stay home. <laughs> yeah, He's like, imagine just that long of a travel. I mean, how long would it take them to travel? Yeah. That long of a travel just to get here. And then and how frustrating would it be to be next to that guy? And he goes, you know what this reminds me of? That road in Greece. And they're like, you're like, dude, we... <laughs> That's not what I want to hear when we've traveled for five years to get here. My family's dead. Yeah. I mean, we've lost people <laughs> on this ride. And then you're going to just immediately get off and go, oh, it tastes like every other restaurant I've ever been to. <laughs> you're like, I mean, you add a little bit to it, man. Like, you know, that, I mean, it's got to be, that guy's a, a nightmare. <laughs> just to go. It's not to be of a road in Greece. Does it? <laughs> So when uh, English settlers came there to settle it, uh, they made a deal with the Native Americans and purchased uh, the area that's now Providence. Providence is the state capital. It's the largest city in Rhode Island. Yeah. Do they like uh, negotiate with the Native Americans? I tried to find what, they, what the Indians got for Just it. want the whole, what's the process like that? How you doing? Ben Johnson. I love what you're doing here. Reminds me of a place at home, actually. And he goes, not a big deal. He goes, what's that? He goes, anyway. Uh, yeah. um, We'd love to make an offer uh, for this land. <laughs> it's purchasing a big land. Uh, the f- founder of Rhode Island, Roger Williams, at first he didn't tell the King of England that he purchased this land. He's like, we got it from the Indians. It's not, not their business. But then things started taking off. And he's like, all right, I got to tell somebody. So, like, it started becoming a big bustling, city. yeah. Like, things are happening here, yeah. yeah. And the and phone was in, invented. This is probably <laughs> he's like, This is for it, yeah. He's like, 
They're like, you know, we can make phone calls back home now. What's that? <laughs> like how like how much he was like, what's the, you can just contact him pretty easy. He goes, yeah, we got him on the phone right now. You want to talk to him? He's like, <sighs> <laughs> he's like, I kind of started my own world. I mean, it's like. <laughs> It's like when Kramer sits in for when Jerry leaves and Kramer dresses up like Jerry and changes an apartment and he's like, hello, who are he goes, why don't we get this? And then someone comes back, what are you doing over there, man? You've been gone for quite a while. Because when they would leave on these trips, they'd be gone for... for oh, but they usually didn't even go back home. But yeah. settlers, yeah. they settled in the U.S. So your job was a settler. Yeah. You were like, I'm a settler. So your job was like, I'm going to go... Nice to meet you. Yeah. I'm okay. going, I'm going to go. Some of them came back, right? You I know? guess some of them did. Did like Columbus, he went back, didn't he? Well, he was an explorer. He wasn't a settler. Oh, okay. That's different. Yeah, so he was everywhere. Yeah. yeah. You couldn't, That's their you thing, couldn't track explorer. that guy down. These he are people that the came over like the pilgrims to, right. to live and to make a new world. Uh-huh. So finally things were taken off and he had to go back to the king and say, we need a patent for a new colony. When they say go back to the king, they it's always written in a, like a sentence. So he had to run back to the king. You're like, <laughs> this is not a, you know, like, I mean, he would like, if you, if we told him the story, how quick we brush over it. He's like, wait a second. Y'all just said, I went back to the king. He goes, he goes, dude, he goes, I lost eight guys. <laughs> I mean, he goes, I had to, I had to hunt a well and try to drag it in the boat and eat it. Yeah. It's the worst time of my life. And y'all just go, so we ran back, uh, talked to the king, told him he came back. And you're like, this was nine years of my life Yeah, was just this going back and forth. And it's probably not easy to just get an audience with the king whenever you want. Just yeah. Once you get back over there. Once huh? you get back. Yeah. I mean, when yeah. your boat, you know, yeah, your boat lands up and you're like, <laughs> you just get off the boat like a plane. <laughs> he goes, oh. Slept the whole way. He goes, there. all right, the king's ready to see. He goes, oh, 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 oh I need like two months to is my I need, get, I need to get my apartment. <laughs> I've left my dog. I, I just let it go. <laughs> see if I can find that yeah. thing. Um, the king granted the colony, and they originally called it Providence Plantations. Because plantation means colony in in England, so for first twenty years it was called Providence Plantations instead of Rhode Island, and then once they became a state after the Revolutionary War, it was called the State of Rhode Island and Providence Plantations. Guy wouldn't let go of that Providence Plantation. He goes, "No, no, it's still doing that." You're like, "Yeah, but you know when? Do you know when they let it go?" I want to say it wasn't probably recently. very recently, yeah. right? Yeah. Two months ago, yeah, up to oh, two, really? two months ago. You can't say plantation. It was anymore. called State of Rhode Island and Providence Plantation. Yeah. Yes, wow. they've yeah. been trying forever to get rid of it. They voted in 2010 and it failed because they were like, "Plantation doesn't mean what you think. It means colony." But finally, this past election, if barely won, 52.8 to 47.2, they changed the name just to Rhode Island. Wow, that's someone just because they go eventually look. You got to pull someone aside and go, hey, it's 2020. You can't say anything anymore. <laughs> and no one's calling it that. <laughs> yeah, dude. You know, no one even knows this. Uh-huh. You know it. It's a matter of, and I get it, dude. <laughs> That's how everybody should talk to everybody. Now. Like, I get it, dude. I get why you want to do it. But where do you live at? He's Rhode Island. Or you, exactly. <laughs> yeah. You're not even saying it. Yeah. I've never a, heard it's of a that. Long, it's a long thing to say. Yeah. You can't. Providence Plantation, you know, like, what are we doing? Yeah. A lot of peas. <laughs> like, come on. You know? With a small estate. We got that. Yeah, we don't need the longest name. We don't need, yeah. We're the smallest state. The name's longer than the state. <laughs> <laughs> By the time you get done saying it, I'm already half across the state. <laughs> what are we doing? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. The official nickname is the Ocean State because it has many large bays and inlets. There's probably a bunch of them. Yep. State bird is the Rhode Island Red, which is a chicken. Just a chicken <laughs> as their bird? It is a it is a chicken? Yeah. It's straight up a chicken. Yeah. It's a rooster or rooster. Who has <laughs> sex with the rooster? <laughs> a chicken. The or... rooster has sex with all of them. <laughs> Seinfeld. Um, yeah. It's a chicken. Roosters and hens are both chickens. There's the Rhode Island Red. That's a good looking that's yeah. a good-looking chicken. Good-looking hen. Well, is it a hen? I mean, that's the one a, that looks like Kramer. Just, fault. Isn't a hen just a male? No, that's a female. A rooster is a male. Yeah. 
All right, let's back up a little bit. Well, and a, a rooster. <laughs> I just said it. Seinfeld. Yeah. You learned it in Seinfeld. The rooster <laughs> mates with the, all of them. The yeah. hen and the chicken. Okay. I don't know the difference of a hen and a chicken. Yeah. I don't mean, know. A hen is a little more mouthier. <laughs> hen. <laughs> <laughs> Hen's little. A hen just never lets go. Oh, God. I should have married a chicken, to be honest. This hen is just all over me. <laughs> and just saying. It's never enough, is it, Hen? <laughs> it's never enough. Oh, uh, the gov- the gov- Why would they make it? A, I guess, yeah. Well, you know that the... I bet by the time the guy that said our, our bird... Why do you even have a state bird? I guess you Every just, state does. Every just, state yeah. has a bird. Uh, I would imagine when they made it the chicken, it was before they realized, like, oh, I could have done an eagle? <laughs> well, they have a different... Well, yeah, you're right, because that's state bird. They have state animals. That's the harbor seal. They have all kinds of... They just thought they could choose, like, chickens and pigeons. And, like, I guess we'll do chickens, I guess chickens, that's good. And then, like, four years later, someone's like, you know, our state bird is a hawk. And you're like, we have those. He's like, yeah, you should have done that. He goes, I didn't know we could do... I thought we had to, like, pick what I saw the most of. You mean you don't do that? He's like, no. You don't want to be... What do you mean, a chicken state? You know, the, um, the American bird was supposed to be a turkey for a long yeah. time and then it they, makes sense thank god they chose the eagle because the eagle's much cooler but the turkey yeah. is you know we're all kind of big a lot of us have gout <laughs> <laughs> maybe you should change to turkey maybe you should change to turkey maybe we're having a little too much turkey and that's how we're getting a little gout you know what i mean uh <laughs> we had an eagle i think it on in our backyard did I ever say that? I don't know. A bald in eagle? Our old, in our old house. Yeah. Oh. A bald eagle. I remember that. A nest. Uh, put a nest and you got to, you just got to let it. I mean, an eagle can just, if an eagle wants to get in your house and just sleep in your bedroom, mm-hmm. then you got to just move out of your bedroom. He's allowed to do whatever he wants. We have no control over the eagles. Mm. I think they legally in, you're not allowed to touch them, right? If they want in their, if they want in your house, they get your house. Yeah. Like an eagle goose. comes in, like yeah. a goose. Yeah, you get an eagle in your house, just m- you move. <laughs> you can try to negotiate with the eagle, but if he doesn't want to leave, the the government's like, well, he's it's his, his living room now. <laughs> you can't touch him. You can't touch him. <laughs> and you got to watch TV and watch what he wants to watch. <laughs> and let me tell you, he he wants to watch. It's not it's not pretty. <laughs> <laughs> he had to get the kids out of the room. You know what I mean? Like, he's definitely not living this podcast. So this is this is not enough for him. Uh, the current governor of Rhode Island is Gina Raimondo. Yeah, she was the first female governor ever when she was elected in no. 2014. But that's she's, uh, she's 2014 leaving. was the, still the first for Rhode Island. Yeah. Oh, oh not of not, not America. No, no, no. Yeah. I was going to no, say. Yeah. For Rhode Island. That's something, though. She gets to say, you know, that's, you know, she's like, I was the first woman governor of Rhode Island. And I bet everybody goes, oh, of like America? And they go, she goes, no. But Rhode Island, I, I bet everybody, I bet if you talk to her, she's like, oh, that's all the time. <laughs> I was the first woman governor of Rhode Island. Of America? It was tw- of America? No, no. Because then, then it just, no. Ro- Ro- just Rhode Island. She goes, oh, oh that's cool, man. That's what they say to her. Yeah. That's cool, man. And she's like, uh, defeats the purpose. Defeats the whole. Uh. She's leaving though to become U.S. Commerce Secretary. Oh no! So she's moving on up. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Rhode Island has the highest density of electoral votes of any state because mm. they're the smallest. But they have a lot of people from being oh. so small, so therefore they have more electoral votes. How many do they get? I think four. Oh. How many people are in Rhode Island? Is it over a million? A over okay, a million. so more than Wyoming, more than Montana, mm-hmm. Alaska. Is that, is that is that under a million? Mm-hmm. Then yeah. <laughs> I mean, you're just naming stuff that we're looking at a number. It's not a we're not. It's not a conversation about it. It's if there's there's over a million. Was there I'm less than a million it there? I'm just putting into perspective because yep. those states are enormous. Yeah, those are enormous. Well, that's when everybody thinks we're all too crowded. You're like, go to Wyoming. There's yeah. There's room. There's plenty of room. Yeah. Go to these other places. Yeah, get out of Rhode Island and you'll see. Get out your your yeah. notice <laughs> that you're like, wow, there's a lot of room <laughs> over here yeah. in Wyoming. Now you're in Wyoming. Just signed a lease. 